Welcome to Xamarin Form Tutorials. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to use segmented control inside our Xamarin Form application. So here is our application and here we used segmented control inside our application. So basically segmented controls are showing the multiple tabs. We can also we can only select only single tabs. Okay, so here is our tabs that's showing the multiple values. Okay, so we can select any of values. So here I'm selecting any of values and uh, depending on the changing the values, we can set the item source inside a label. So how to achieve this using segmented control? To use seg segmented control inside our Xamarin form application, we need to use a NuGet package. So uh, inside our solution, go to the solution and go to the manage NuGet package for solution. And on the browse tab, search for segmented control. And here is the segmented control dot dot net standard. Before installing these plugins, make sure that you already have that Xamarin form latest version. If you don't have the Xamarin form latest version, then you need to install the downgrade versions and lower versions. Okay, so I already have the Xamarin form update version that is uh, 4.2 so that is the main reason i am updating the latest version of this segmented control plugin so after installing this plugin inside all of this project go to the ios project and inside the ios project go to the app delegate class and inside this class after initializing the xamarin form application xamarin form packages initialize the segmented control renderer dot initialize so we only need to initialize this segmented control inside our iOS project only. So we don't need to initialize this segmented control inside our Android project. We don't need this. So uh, after initializing these packages, go to the main page. And after going to the main page, I just added my namespace for segmented control. So here is my namespace. And I added this namespace for using this segmented control. And after this controls dot segmented controls and here I am giving the segmented control name and selected segment 0 and also giving the tint color and the text color as white and uh, here I am adding an event called segmented control on segment selected. This event will call when we change the segmented and we when we select any of tab inside the segmented controls. And the disabled color is gray. So inside this segmented control children's, we just added three hard coded value. First one is male, female, and others. So uh, that's it. So uh, under this segmented control, we just uh, create a label, and inside this label, we just update the selected value. So here is our event function segmented control dot segment selected, and we just implement this segment selected event inside our backend page so here is our segmented control on segment selected event and inside this event we just getting this argument as e and we just fetch the new value e dot new value and we just get the selected index so using this switch case we just update the selected indexed value so we also can use the dynamic value inside our segmented control property we just use the item source and also inside this this item source we can bind our any of the list item inside the segmented control so that's for today so uh, using this segmented control we just use a tab view segmented control and it is very help, helpful for selecting the single item inside our xamarin form project so that's for today thank you for watching have a great day